Sometimes, I forget how valuable the little things are. That first sip of morning coffee, or watching the sunrise, someone giving you a genuine smile when you're having a shitty day. I could go on and on. I get so wrapped up in social media and what everyone else is doing that I start losing myself in the process. I expect myself to be a millionaire by 25, be married with two kids, and taking trips to Turks or wherever I want to go. Will I reach those expectations? Who knows? Who knows if that's even what I really want? Social media is starting to feel not so social. Instead of using the platform to build and grow community with our fellow humans, we use it to further divide each other. Men versus women, Christians versus atheists, blacks versus whites, the list goes on and on. Now, to even go on a date, I need to be making six figures. And if I'm not, I'm out of luck because... And now back to your regularly scheduled program. It's bad enough life is already filled with suffering. People die. Things happen. Life sucks. We suffer regardless. But at least we can choose how we suffer. You can suffer from doing something beneficial like exercising. Or you can suffer from being unhealthy because you didn't exercise. We have access to things that our ancestors didn't even have. We can look at titties whenever we want. We can smoke weed until our problems don't matter. We can party our 20s away, yet none of it fulfills me. If I'm gonna die anyway and my suffering is guaranteed, I'd rather choose how and why. Instead of worrying about how many followers I have, focus on, instead, the real friends that you have, that check up on you and support you and love you despite your flaws. You can choose happiness or misery. There are people in the world with less who are way happier. Even in the space I'm in, where creatives aren't really supported until they make it. I know people living in terrible conditions, still happy because they're doing what they love, despite not having a society with deem as good or necessary. Somebody once said, life is what you make it, and I believe that still rings true. No matter the time, place, or environment, you can change your life into something you enjoy.